This video is about how to make Santa Salto tree decorations. So what you need is one cup of fine salt, then you'll need one cup of flour, actually no wait, it was two cups of flour. Mix it all around and then add one cup of water but add it really slowly because I added mine way too fast and it got a bit crap. So this is what happened to mine and it got a bit mushy and I had to mix like hell and then keep adding flour. I don't know how much extra flour I added. I just added some, mixed it, added some, mixed it until it looked right. So until it looks like this. Then what you want to do is flour a board and kind of just squidge it around. Knead it really, but all I did was kind of squidge until it looks like this. Then put it in a bowl and wait for your child. Oh, actually, roll it out first. Yay, so we got Tilly. And she did not want to put her hands anywhere near it. She wanted to draw on the salt dough. And she wanted to eat it. I've included a little clip of her talking because I just think it's super cute. Oh, we've got one hand there. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Squish. Oh. <laughs> no, Tilly, no! no oh Tilly. no! Very, Yuck! Very, very salty, I'm afraid. You should have a picture of her eating it in the video. Can you take a little. Yuck! Once she tastes it, she'll say yuck. She's been tasting it, Mum. She looks, it's lovely! <laughs> Better not let your baby taste them. Oh! Oh, look at the face now! So because Tilly wasn't cooperating, all we did was we traced around her hand and then cut that out into a piece of paper and then that's what we used to shape it. So cut around it, get a fish slice because the dough was really flimsy. And if your hand looks like ours, then just put it on some bake a baking paper on a baking tray and kind of mould the hands so they look a bit more human. Then what you need to do is you need to set your oven to, I think it was 150? Oh, and I used a straw just to make little holes for the ribbon to go through. So we're going to hang them on our tree. And then pop them in your oven and let them bake for about two hours. Then when they're finally done, you can get to the painting bit. So ours kind of came out a bit lumpy, a bit 3D-ish, but uh, I quite like them like that. Got some white, gold, bronze, red, orange, yellow, and black paint. Then I also got some gold spray that I thought would be cool. It's not cool, don't use it, forget I even had it there. And then I just got various brushes of various sizes and some red ribbon. So I just painted everything up. I'm gonna speed this up because it's pretty boring. Oh, I did wanna say, See the Santa hand that I'm painting now? Don't do the white like that. Paint on the pink first, or else you're going to have to carefully paint in the pink bits later. They're all done. So then I just got a piece of red ribbon and tied a hole or tied it around it and did a little bow on it because I think it looks cute. And I didn't do the rest of them because I'm kind of lazy. I'm really disappointed with how the snowman looks because I think the way I placed his eyes, I think it looks like he wants somebody to kill him. 
And the gingerbread smile doesn't look too great either. Oh dear. Yeah, look at him. Oh, he looks so sad. But yeah, they're all finished. And I think they're they're going to look pretty cute on the tree. <laughs>